Okay, this time I'm talking about backup plan. We all got backup plans, right? For something goes wrong as a performer, um, what to do? You got to have a backup plan. Well, as a coordinator, you also need a backup plan. What happens when you have cancellations or no shows? And it's not like it's a, a week before on the cancellation, so you don't have time to get somebody else. Now, the no shows, those are just always surprises because that happens at the event, and there's nothing you can do about that. But, well, let me, let me rephrase actually, there is something you can do about it if you have a backup plan. And once you've done this for a while, the coordinating, you'll learn about a backup plan. And it sometimes can be with the people that you have surrounding you, helping you do sound and, and uh, all the other help that you have. Um, my backup plan, and I learned this early on, it was just a coincidence, a mistake, I guess, but uh, early on, we would have too much time in between entertainers. That's how we booked it at first, because we didn't know what we were doing. But my oldest nephew, Tom, he was helping me, and he's a great singer, and so occasionally we'd have him sing. Well, when there was a no-show suddenly, Somebody had to get up there and sing. And that was before I was actually doing the performing because I was too scared to perform. And so we'd have Tom get up there and fill in that time. And so that was kind of a backup plan. And we learned that if you have less time between setups, people will stick around. And when people stick around, they, they get more food at the food booths and drink more pop and, and they come back and enjoy the entertainment. And they enjoy the whole event. So the backup plan. And now, uh, sometimes I'm the backup plan, because I'll perform if somebody doesn't take up enough time, or they are no-shows, or a last-minute cancellation that you just can't get anybody else for, I take up that time. Also, we have uh, one, of, one of our main guys around here, he's also just a world-class sound tech, and that's Jason Parton. He's also a performer, great performer. I'll have him on certain days at our event do sound. And I'll also book him for, for a time slot for him to perform because people like him and he's a great performer. But if they don't take up enough time, he's ready just to plug in his guitar and go up and, and uh, fill in. And so he's a backup plan. So you might think about that when you're putting your event together, who you have helping. If you got some people that can set up really fast, whether it be plug in a CD player and sing a song or two while you're waiting for the next act, or plug in the guitar and set up the microphone and, and they can fill in. And, okay, so what if they're the sound tech? So what if they're the announcer? So what if there's somebody that's just helping? You, you want this to be a community event. You want to have that sense of pride and community in all the people helping. So have a backup plan. Other performers are willing to do this. The only time when uh, backup plans don't always, don't always work is when there's a last minute no-show. Because I get lots of performers and all kinds of people that say, hey, if you have a no-show, give me a call. Problem is, when there's a no-show, I need you now. You know, that's, that seems obvious. But the cancellations, that's easy. Because you can call them right then and say, hey, tomorrow, next week, we got another opening. The cancellations are no big deal. It's the no-shows that are the problem. And how do you handle no-shows with your backup plan? You know, a lot of times I talk to the no-shows and, and just let them know, hey, we can't do this. I mean, if, if you are going to consistently be no-show, we can't use you. No event can use you. You've got to, you got to put it out there that you want to perform. And the only way you can do that is by showing up and performing. So, there's your backup plan. And, you know, you, you live, you learn when you do this long enough. You learn what works for you and what doesn't. Uh, but think about your backup plan.